right. Good morning. Hello. Let's just see if the stream's am going. I, <laughs> am I good? Uh, I think so. Right. There's a lot of new stuff going on this morning. Hello, pretty cat. Welcome to our stream. This is Dead Flesh Retro. Hi, Lee. Uh, uh, hey, morning. That was good. Uh, so there's a lot going on this morning. There's a lot of there's a lot of technical shenanigans going on in our stream this morning because, uh, for one thing, we've got new headsets. So uh, hey. let us know if this sounds okay. Whether we need to turn our our voices down. It looks like our voices are a little loud. Yippee! <laughs> Maybe I'll just turn our voices down a tad. But. No, this is way too big. It's way too what? Oh. Oops. Turn the monitor down. There you go. So, yeah, so rather than trying to use a little distorted... Oh, dear, that's, that's not something that we can really do anything about. I hope it sounds okay. You stick it back on. So yeah, so we're using kind of we're, we're trialing. What? It'll still go over your head, won't it? It'll just put it a bit further back and move the microphone down. There you go. How's that? Yeah. So yeah, rather than having two. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, I think it's still it's still clipping a little bit. Let's have a look. There we go. All right. Say something in a normal voice. Hello. Hello. Okay. Yeah, so rather than having two USB headsets, we've got um, basically like <laughs> call center headsets that are wireless, but not uh, Bluetooth. You're sweaty. I'm sweaty. It's really hot in here. So oh. that, that's that's technical innovation number one. I so just said it's not that hot, but I've been under a heat level You've been under, yeah, you've been under an electric five hours. all morning. <laughs> On heat level this must five. Feel cold. This is freezing to me. <laughs> you didn't want to come out of it, did you? No. No. Um, so yeah, so there's that. And but the other technical innovation. <laughs> I wanted um, to bring it up here. Is uh, yeah, you you can't bring the electric blanket up here though. No. It's too big and it's got wires Aww. coming out of it, and we've got frankly enough wires. Um, but we're going to try playing this this morning. Bob is also now officially our cat. Bob is now officially our cat. Yeah. No longer the neighbours. No. Nope. She's ours. She's adopted us, and we have adopted her. We and just paid about a hundred quid for insurance. <laughs> yeah, something like that. <laughs> or we're about to, yeah. And she's she's a she's asleep down here. We did try. <laughs> we did try to put another camera in so that you can see the setup we've got, um, but that didn't work very well this morning. The system wasn't very happy about having two Logitech cameras plugged in. So we might try that again using a an iPhone, an iPhone relay. Um, in the meantime, let's get going before Flynn falls asleep. He's very tired this morning because it's a Sunday. I'm going to the but skate park. You're going to the skate park later, which will be awesome fun, won't it? Yeah. I don't even know how it loads tapes. Right. So should, should we should we talk about what we've got in front of us? We've so got, we've got the should Atari. Should we take it out? Should we take it out? Take yeah, let's take it out. So. It's actually plugged into the tape. Oh god, it came deck. up. Oh no. It's alright. <laughs> Just put it up on again. So if you can see this, this is the famous Starpath supercharger, or actually this is an uh, Arcadia one. This is one of the early ones. Yeah, another camera would be cool. I know. I really wanted to do it this morning. Um but yeah, I, I couldn't get the two things to play nicely together, but I've got another solution. So well I'm sure we'll do another Starpath game. Uh, at some point, and you can see how this is set up, if this even works. I mean, we do have a contingency, even if we can't load it, the original game off tape, uh, we've got it running on the um, on the Uno cart, so we can always play it off that. Um, but let's let's give this a go. So so this is the, this is the Arcadia um, that was later Starpath Supercharger, that allows you to load games off tape onto the Atari, which means the games can be a bit more sophisticated, and it's got some extra extra RAM. Um, and and uh, capability that the native um, Atari doesn't have. So is that Mike is here? plugged in. Is Mike here? Mike, are you here? Uh, not sure if we're on in, in the lounge. Are the we moment. on in the lounge? I don't know. I don't know. Let's see if he uh, if he tunes in. So that has a lead it that says goes to. Let's see if watching. I can show this. All right, cool. 
So that has a lead that goes to this uh, WH Smith's tape deck. Can we um, turn so the beep beep on so we can hear? You want to hear? You want to monitor it as it plays in? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So you can switch that to monitor. Okay. Shall we do, do it? Do you want to start it? I'll okay, start wait, it. Okay. Wait. 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 So. You need to right, rewind. We can do this it. on our lap. Uh, no, it's, so it's rewound, but you need to put the, turn the power off first. So put the power on. Then you need to turn the Atari on. Okay, and now we should get... Um, yeah, there we go. So rewind tape and press play. Rewind tape. Um, so just one thing to say. Um, this tape has two sides. And the, the main side is the fast side. Hey, Mike, here's the... Are we on a lounge? So, th so this, yeah. So this tape has two sides: a fast side and a slow side. So if it doesn't load off the fast side, you've got it recorded at a slower or a, at a smaller bit rate uh, on the second side. So it's it's safer, more likely to load. So you've got fast load and slow load. So we're going to try it on fast load, and I'm almost certain it isn't going to work because I have tried this out. Can I? So we're going to put the volume to about three quarters. We've got the monitor on. All right, press, press play. Press it right down. Hard. All right, there we go. Oh, what? Hang on. There we go. Oh dear. That's a good start. Maybe it's because I've got it on my lap. That actually sounds like. Oh no. Oh dear. So that doesn't sound good. For some reason, this tape isn't turning. How brilliant is that? That literally worked perfectly well half an hour ago there you go no listen to it listen how listen how that's bad We're on in the lounge. That's cool. Do you know what we need? We need a pencil. <laughs> we need a good old pencil. I'm too tired, you to get check. it. No. It's alright, I can do it with my finger. So that is turning. Your finger's a pencil. Just goes to show, doesn't it? Well, that's really disappointing. Really disappointing. Go and try another tape quickly just to see. The joys of cassette tape gaming. Yeah, really. That's <laughs> what Mike says. I know, it literally worked when I tried it half an hour ago. It was absolutely fine. But it looks like it's the tape. Let's just try. Okay, so it's, it's definitely the tape, not the tape deck, because that seems to be working. So let's see. Classic noise. That is classic noise, but it's not being picked up by the star path either. Let's just see. 
Is that a Star Pass game? It is a Star Pass game. Can you guys hear that? <laughs> can they hear it? Uh, I'm not, they can probably only hear it through our microphone. But let's just check this. It's a classic sound, that's for sure. It is a classic sound. Mm, I'm gonna hop knob. Luckily, this, this cassette uh, is actually screwed. I mean, it may be completely screwed, but it is on top of being screwed, it's held together with screws. Um, so if everything fails, we can always, I mean, we can play the game <laughs> off the other version. Here we go. So this is um, Dragon Stomper loading as a test on the slow side of the tape. And if this loads okay, I'm going to try Phaser Patrol one more time. So hopefully it won't say rewind or anything at the end. It'll say stop tape. It says stop tape. And look at that. Oh really? That wasn't me. That was that was Mum. I think so. Right, let me just message her. Yeah. So there you go. So that that actually worked. So that is an Atari loading a tape, loading off tape, and it's loaded Dragon Stomper, which is. It's a really interesting and weird game. It's a we might do another another one on Dragon Stomper. It's a, one of the first RPGs. So you control that little dot, and you can go around and uh, kill things. But we're not here to play that. <laughs> I'm a dot killing things. I'm glad about the fact that it works though. Let's see if we can get. Phase oh no, a beetle! You've hit. You are hit. Playing? Is it in autoplay? <laughs> <laughs> All right. You just hit the beetle. There seems to be just a lot of friction on this uh, phase patrol tape for some reason. Yeah, the beetle missed. Really... You just hit the beetle <laughs> for one unit. <laughs> the beetle missed. You missed the beetle. The beetle missed. You missed the beetle. You were hit. Oh, you take one, one unit damage. damage. Fight. You hit... You missed the beetle. The beetle missed you. You killed the beetle. Finally, I gained three gold from a beetle. Okay, I'm gonna give this one more go. You ready? No, I'm playing. <laughs> You're playing Dragon Stopper. I don't think you can get into the car yet. I think you need to. Um, I think you need to find a key for it somehow. You can it, it, try going off screen. Actually, it's locked. Try going off screen, because uh, I've got a feeling. Can you can you go off screen? Can you move? There you go. Look at scrolls. So it's like a whole outdoor wilderness. It's like Skyrim. It's like. Me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. What's that? It's Skyrim from like 1982. Champ. Oh look, it's like churches. Oh no, demon. demon! I think you've had it. The demon missed me. I hit 
I missed the demon. Yeah, um, Lee the says it feels missed. bizarre. My first computer was an Atari 800, which had both cassette and cartridge, but rarely did anyone have games on cartridge. I might yeah, they were so much more expensive, demon. and you know, I think people were just like, well. I'm... This falls off. Okay. So much. Alright, well, yeah. It does work, though. So. Ish. <laughs> Should we try loading Phaser Patrol? No, I'm playing Dragon Rust. Alright. Play, play Dragon Stomper until you die, though. I killed the demon! Ah. Wow. Bye bye. Can you, can you go into one of those churches? What are they? I think they're. Go and get some loot. I know a oh, snake. No, a came. snake. This is. It's so weird seeing this because it's still. It's still all. Um, obviously on an Atari 2600 because you can see all the kind of tripl triplication of the. Of the sprites. I gain a gain ring. a ring. What can you do with that, I wonder? I. Can you go in there? I'm a murderer. The church, church is, is locked. locked. Okay, nobody here. Yeah, <laughs> Skyrim from a bird's eye view. Another, Another snake. snake. Uh oh, I'm taking four hits. I think I think there's a I think there's a status page as well. I think you can look at your status to see how many. Oh, come, on. please kill it. Snake missed. Fight. You kill the snake. You gain a cross. Okay. And Forty-one gold. Can you have a look at your status to see? Oh my. <laughs> Relentless, aren't they? <laughs> Uh, these streams are so funny. Like, uh, they always go in unexpected directions. So there you go. We're just noodling. Oh, it, I haven't lasted like more than three fights when I've ever, when I've played this game. Then you're bad at it. Yeah, maybe I am. Um, have a look at your status. Can you see how many hit points you've got and stuff? Just stop a sec. Status, go down. Right, 450 gold, 2 strength, 23 dexterity, what else? Across a ring, what else? Was that it? Where's your um hit points? I need the loo, don't die. Uh, oh, don't die? What if something comes? Then kill it! Okay, shall I just stay there then? You just, like, You go to go the edge of the loo. Right. Duh, duh, right, duh, duh, right. Right for fight. Duh, duh right, okay, yeah. yeah. Right is for fight. Okay, I'll, Bye. Just, I'll just stay here then. Um, t turn your microphone off when you go to the loo. I have to say, I'm amazed at this game. I'm amazed that Flynn just started playing this game, naturally. That's quite rare <laughs> for old games. <laughs> oh, a monkey. <laughs> Give you that. Okay, well thank god that didn't happen to me. That is brilliant. I'm gonna I'm gonna try loading phase patrol now though, okay? You wanna play Dragon Stomper? Ah unbelievable. We're gonna play we're gonna play Phaser Patrol and then we can play Dragon Stomper afterwards. So yeah, well at least at least we can load things off tape. Right. Let's try this again. Okay. Oh, I'm sure this is not going to work. Let's see. Okay. All right, slapping against my hand a few times like we used to do. Oh, it wasn't me playing. It wasn't me playing, Lee. It wasn't. He he grabbed the um, joystick before he went to the loo, so it's not my responsibility. <laughs> I'm very pleased to say. <laughs> Flynn, Flynn died himself of his own accord. Is it going to load? 
Please say stop the tape. Stop the tape. All right. Half loader or slow? No, that was a slow loader. But it... Yay! <laughs> Check it out. We have played this before. We have played this before, yeah. We have played it before. Um, but a while ago, and not on the stream. Yes, on the stream. No, we have not. Surely. Have we? Comment. <laughs> comment, comment. <laughs> Where's I'm not, I'm not going to wear my mic because it annoys me. Aw, oh, really? It's awful. Uh, okay, well, we need to figure out how to get it to stay on because this is a much better solution than having two headsets. Maybe like one mic and one headset. I, I, wanna, I need to know whether or not I'm sending these back or keeping them because they weren't cheap. They weren't massively expensive, but... They weren't cheap either. No, they cost money. Even if you have kind of like stick it so that it's along, uh, you know, on the back of your head, those dangling down. I have to say, they're not the comfiest, comfiest of things. Okay, let's go. Anyway, you good? Yes, we've played this on stream. Have we played this on stream? We've, we've played Star Raiders and we've played Star Master. And we've played Phase of Patrol. I don't think we have. Yeah, we did. What, like spontaneously, like at the end of a stream? Because we've never done a stream on it. We've we've played it because we've played through all of the star Mar of the star path of the supercharger games. But it doesn't really matter. Oh yeah, so you're saying these games load really quickly? That that was on the slow load side as well. The fast load side is about half the time. But, but remember, this is an Atari 2600 game, right? It's only got, it's like 4K ROM size. Um, so that, so wait, 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 wait. No, so that is Shield. This is the star map. Um, that's the difficulty setting. Here we go. So look at the star map. So you've got, you've got two bases at the top. Um, and you can't see what's in any of those other sectors. So you can move to a new sector and walk to it, and then it will show you what's in the immediate vicinity. So that's a good one to walk to. That'll cost you 400 to walk to. So when we arrive there... Okay, so there's a... There's a bad guy in the sector... Oops. There's a bad guy in the sector above us. Are you walking there? Yeah, go out. Okay. So you've, you've got your radar in the middle, and when you... There he is, he's over there. If you manage to, to lock onto him... Yeah! Yay! We've played this before. Yeah, yeah. I know we've played this before. I know we have. It's a really good game. Because cause you've got, you've got um, homing missiles. Ah, oh, nearly. It's also very satisfying. Nearly. So when it goes red, if you fire when it goes red, you'll get homing. I know how to play it. Ow! Oh, what did that Stupid hit? little. Uh, you're okay. You Doesn't robot. do any damage. Hey, stop! I got you when it was red. Hey, hey, hey! No, bad, bad right. boy. Very bad boy. Bad. It's really, it's really quite bad. difficult to keep it. Bad boy. You're a very bad boy. Stop moving so I can shoot you! <laughs> That's good. Alright, so uh, is this sector clear now? Yeah, I think it's clear. Alright. You've actually moved into another sector in the course of that battle. More aliens! Hello aliens, where are you aliens? Oh, are you okay? You're okay. These are different type of aliens. I haven't seen these ones. No, they're not. It's the same as we just fought. No, those ones are, but those 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 ones look like like um, spades, you know, in cards. That was a good one. Good shot. One more to get here. Oh, beauty! Oh no, you've got you've got more warping in here. I think they're all converging on your space stations because we're oh, that hit. 
you're good, you're good. You've still got plenty of energy as well. And I think you've got a space station in the sector above you. Has it gone green? Okay, we're green, we're green. Okay, yeah, make your way towards the space station. You can refuel when you get there. Yeah, so th this was the um, this was the the launch title for this for the uh, supercharger. This this came with the original supercharger uh, when you bought it in the shops. And I think it's a really impressive game. I mean, I think there's two. It just got off to such a good start. This I'm this pretty um, sure there's another one. This kit. I mean, it wasn't cheap at the time, but seeing as Atari yeah, had spent so long getting the 5200 out and it messed that up so badly. Oh, oh, okay, so you're out of lasers. Oh no, you're good. All right, that you need to get to the space station. Oh, you still got a bad guy in this sector, though. Oh no, your long-range scanner's gone out. That's what that means, not your laser. No, I haven't. You got another one, another two. Oh no. Okay, it's only your long-range scanner that's gone out, and that doesn't really matter, because we know where the space station is. Oh, good shot. Where's the other guy? He's over to the right. There he is. Oh, I'm lucky. Bad. Oh, you got him. That wasn't even homing. No, no, it wasn't. You just he just him. went into him. Okay, go up then. So. Stand by. Stand, just, just wait. Just, there we go. You're all good. Okay. Now, where are you going to go? Go down to that one? That, that's it. Any idea what the SCLT are? Ah, yeah, so S is shields, and the shields are currently on, so they're using up energy. Uh, C is computer, so I think that shows us... Um, Almost. The, uh, the radar. Now. Come on. And our control panel. L is long-range scanner. So that's the galactic map. You basically Got can't him. add it to anything. Okay, okay I'm you're clear. good. Clear. Go to the other one. There's another one. Okay. I can't move. You have to go right over there. That's it's gonna cost you a lot in travel travel energy. But you can always refuel. You've got plenty actually, go. Okay. That's just one hundred. Oh, does it does it wrap? Maybe it wraps. You're right, that wasn't E one hundred. Uh and T is torpedo, so if your T uh, is damaged, you can't fire anymore. And I think there's two stages, so green is good, obviously, then there's a kind of orange and red, and if it's red, they're completely out. But you can repair at the space stations. I th we're playing it on easy mode at the moment, which uh, I think means that... Did you see wow, that, that shot? shot. Um, which I think means that the shields don't take quite as much energy. And there's two space stations in this in the in the ma in this galaxy. In this sector. There we go. There's another guy. There's another guy. There isn't. You're green. I just saw him go past me, so you, it must, must have be been a shot me. because you're definitely green. Look, your status indicators. Those big boxes on the left and right. Yeah, I, I can see. Those are. Your okay, so you've still got some hiding. So go go to the one that's gonna give you the most visibility. Yeah, that's a good one. yeah, that's a good one. I'm pretty sure it'll give me some visibility. Give me, give me, give me, give me. There are a lot of enemies. Yeah, so this is a precursor to Elite, um, and you can kind of see how. I mean, obviously, Star Raiders is the daddy. Dive fiendish spaceship. Um, but yeah, Star Master that we played a few weeks ago is another no. one. Um, Where's the other guy? And we've also got um, Star Voyager, which is iMagic's entry into the space combat. I'm pretty sure we played that on stream though. Star Voyager? Yeah. No, we've never. I don't think we've ever played it at all, to be honest. Right. We might give it a We're crack safe. though after this. We're safe. You're bossing this. Ah, oh, look, you've got them right around you. Come. 
Where are so they? yeah, if you watch, um, I don't know if you've ever seen uh, From Bedrooms to Billions, the documentary, they have a, there's an interview with David Brabham about Elite and about um, going and trying to sell bah. the game to, to different publishers. Bah. And, Almost. you know, a bunch bah. of people in suits telling him that they didn't understand why it was fun yes. or they didn't think it would sell very well because, they, they, you know, there was no, it didn't look like a normal video game. There was no score. You couldn't get a high score on it. Um, they just couldn't get their heads around it, and so they didn't offer him a deal and passed on it. And he found it quite hard to, to get a publishing deal, apparently. And then he did, and then it was, like, amazing. Yeah, of course. Yeah, it was uh, iconic, absolutely brilliant. But it's not as if Elite. it came Elite completely Elite is your favourite game, isn't it? Yeah, it was It was my favourite game. Solaris is mine. I absolutely adore That was Elite. a good shot. That was a great shot. There's another one ahead, so... You're awesome at this. I'm good at first person shooters, what can I say? <laughs> you're, you're absolutely amazing at Atari games, basically. This is this is so funny. <laughs> I'm really good at first person shooters. You are. So really, really simple first person shooters on an old video game. It's easy. Yeah, you're like headshot. Headshot. There was a new leader. I'm good at, like, not first-person shooters and just, like, oh. regular VR shooters. Like, Crisis VR Brigade. Everyone says it's really hard to aim, but I just hit everyone on, like, the third or fourth oh, you got him, you got him. I got him in the blast. You did. Ah, I missed. This, is, this, is, this has got to be the most satisfying... Nice. This has got to be the really hardest game the hardest. to get homing if you are colorblind. Oh, well, yeah. If you're red-green colorblind. Forget it. G games really um, didn't have to pay much attention to accessibility <laughs> back in these days. A school kid Especially was things like um, like epilepsy. I mean, I I'm quite worried actually. I need to put some warnings on our, some of our videos because there's a lot of flashing on some of these old games. Should we go, oh, go to the go space to the, station? Go to the one right in the middle between the space station. Uh, you can go to the space station if you want to. Like here? Uh, well, actually go to the place space station and refuel and then you... Then you'll be all set for your final. Give me the... Again, you don't have to actually dock. That's the one thing that you don't have to do in this game. Like, unlike the Atari 8-bit version of um, Star Raiders. Oh, look, one right Aliens. There. And the this all out? Where, where docking was, was really hard until you get a docking computer. When I clear this all out, will I win? Yeah. Good shot. Oh. Good shot. You got another one. Where is Where it? Where is it? Over there. 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 So yeah, I mean, the things like the things like the radar. Well, I think Elite's radar is so good because it shows you. I'm constantly in moving so none space. of the things hit me. It was a real me. major innovation that I think made the game. I'm moving all around the place so no one hits me. I mean, it, it, in fact, the, the radar in Elite is so Get good em. that it's exactly the same in uh, Elite Dangerous. They, there's been no no need to update it at all. You got two more sectors. Go to this one. But of course, the radar. I think the first. Oh, radar it's clear! It's clear! It's oh. clear! Go to a different one. That must be must be bad guys there then. Unless go! Go! Out! Out! Out of the map! Out of the map! Yeah. I wasn't sure if the game finishes when the or there's no enemies left, or when there's no enemies left and you've, um, you've, I de you know, you've mapped the whole. Am I dead? Dam you know, the computer's damaged; it's not destroyed. So, yeah, so you, you, your radar doesn't work anymore. I don't mind. Cause I got that aim. Are there any more? Uh, I don't. I don't know if you're. Uh, there. If the sector. Oh yeah, there's one. Oh my no, god. No, there isn't. There must be at least one left then. Because mm -hmm. this it should end unless you have to get there. to the space station. Oh my god. That's it. Green. <laughs> Woo destroyed. Absolutely epic. Pilot level C. <laughs> That's really good. Well done. <laughs> I'm really good. I got all of it. 
shot. You did. You were absolutely bossing it at the end. We are definitely making a like highlights reel. Yeah. <laughs> all of the good things, like when you, like when we beat, like when I beat you at like one pixel. Oh god, yeah, in a Indy 500. In Indy 500. Oh my god. And then, and yeah. then when, um, and then when you hit the last Space Invader on the Invisible Quick. Yeah. That was epic. That was epic. <laughs> and then. I did it twice. You did, didn't yeah. you? And then when we when we finished um, Adventure on level two. Yeah. That was good. That was so frustrating. Like playing that yeah, game. we weren't even like screaming and having a tweet. Finally, <laughs> bye everyone. Uh, turn off the stream. <laughs> um, um. All right. Do you want to try it on the dif- on a higher difficulty? I mean. Nope. You've got to do it. I've you've got, got to try. I've got to play this game. You've got to play the game. On the same on the same you level. You got to play the game. Right, I'm gonna. Fair enough. I need to sit down properly then. Honestly, I want to play the game, but you can play the game. You need to do my um my map for me then. This is really uncomfortable. What leaning forwards yeah. or your headset? They're just leaning forwards. Oh, leaning forward. Okay. So yeah, I've got the headset in a good here. position. Oh, that's good. Hooray. So y- yeah, to tell us whether this headset is working. Uh, these headsets are working because if uh, if the sound is good enough, then we'll keep them. Oh look, he says, move your microphone slightly away from your mouth. I think we've got. Uh, can I have the map up? And off again. Is the game? Is I can't the game fix sound? it with my middle toe. Oh no! Is the game sound feeding back? Is the question through our microphones? Because that's what we've been trying to avoid. All right. Oh. Just catch the bullet. Man. I was like curving the bullet. Yeah, it's so satisfying. Oh no! Already, my computer's destroyed. Okay. <laughs> it's destroyed. Can it? Can I have the map up, please? I guess oh space station you plow. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> oh, that's perfect. Did you see that? What? Can I can I have my map off, please? Oh, it doesn't actually matter. I put it back on. It can stay there. Yeah, the comment about your headset. Map off. Th- these games at this l- stage. Uh, are really showing the limitation of only having one fire button. So, a lot of these games... There's not one fire button, there's two fire buttons. Well, yeah, but they're the same, aren't they? You know, the Atari standard is uh, eight direction joystick and one I fire mean, button. I mean, there is the Atari... please? You never asked me. Well, I, when, I, when I go green in the sector, you can move the map up and you can turn it off again now. All right, so... It is off, Dad. Thank you. Almost. Right. Almost. 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 Yeah, without without the homing. Almost. Ah. Almost got him. So close. Right. Yes. You did it. Okay, then there's that one. Oh, <laughs> that, was, that was almost really, we'll really. Well. That was awesome. That was almost really flow. Yeah. Like keep was, going. Yeah, yeah. Like just. Just sh- one sh- shot. <laughs> no. All right. Space station. Um, I don't really need my long range scanner if I go and get this guy. Still got plenty of energy. One of the other design features of this game, I think, is that it is uh, like a lot of these games were just brutally hard. Nice shot. Okay. Um, but this is basically it's doable, and it just scores you by how long you take and how much energy you use. So you know it's. 
It's very forgiving. It's very modern in its. Uh, yeah, go in the middle of those. Middle of these. Up one. There. Yeah, there. Almost. Flicker, didn't it? There you go. Bye bye. Ooh. Oh, down. Ah. Oh, so oh, close. Wow, that would have been really sleek if you got that. There you go, that's good. Oh, you just it. stayed still. I did, I did. I was looking at I was looking at the computer and then it immediately failed. <laughs> like, I'm looking at the computer. Yes, good. Oh, look at oh, what we're targeting. Is that do I, need target, do I need the computer for targeting? Can you see? Oh, uh, should we go? <laughs> do you want to go? <laughs> should we go? Get you, I'm going to get you. Oh, there's two of them now. Should I, we? I might have to go. Bail! Bail! Oh, damn it. Out! Out! Out you go! No, go. go left! Right! Rather. Go, go, go! Bail! Bail! <laughs> you don't have to go out of the map, actually. It's very... It's very nice. I would like it. I would like it. You <laughs> if you had nice to find your space well. station and actually dock with it. And it would be nice if... Um, that would be nice. That if would you be had to frustrating. Um, fight your way to it. Oh, wait. Well. Right, right. To the right. <laughs> Always turn off easy. the map while Sorry. you're in the middle of hyperspace. Yeah. That's a good idea. Yeah, you never did it to me. Good Hello? shot! Another one? Oh. Oh. That was it. Yep. Boop beep beep boop beep boop boop beep boop beep boop beep boop beep boop beep boop beep 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 boop beep boop beep boop beep boop yeah, did I finish saying what there I was saying about about um, radars? Because uh, of course no. Defender had a radar, which I think may have been. Oh, um, Battlezone. Battlezone had a radar, of course. My hand's slipping. There you go. You got sweaty palms. You're too excited. My legs certainly oh. are excited. <laughs> Look at them. <laughs> Where the sound go? Um, please don't. Please don't. I'm fighting here. I thought it went green. No, I think the um, I think the sound went because uh, a certain person, certain AI, thought she heard her name mentioned. What are you doing? I th I keep thinking. <laughs> <laughs> You've got more faith in me than uh, than you should because I'm not actually finished it yet. Oh. Much more faith in you. Ah, <laughs> oh, I thought I had Flickered. that. There you go. Oh, that's so satisfying. That's one of the best features. That's that's more satisfying than Elite actually. Go go Elite, go up 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 up. Elite up. never had no, left. homing, where your shots curl. Towards the target. That is a good feature. That is a really good feature. This is a very satisfying game. What a great launch title. There's one there. Ah. Ooh, that works. Don't mind locking into a sh shot. There oh. you go. Alright, one more. Two more. There seems to be a lot of these. There. There you go. Oops. And then there's go. Whoa. That was oh. sleek. Got more, got more. Smooth, like what's really not butter. Smooth as sandpaper. <laughs> Smooth as what's really not made out of butter, butter, butter. <laughs> Stop. You right down there. Mm, slowly going mad. Okay. <laughs> what do you want to play after this? You want to play Star Voyager? Yeah, give that a try. No, I want to. I want to play this again. You want to play this again? Yeah! Oh my god! I want to be that, shooting. That is great. I love it. You're gonna, you're gonna have to do it on hard though. That was. Oh come no! Come on. We, wanna, we need to check out what the difference is. 
You need to check out what the difference is with your terrible skills at this game. Well. I mean, they're not terrible. <gasps> that was slick. Yeah. I, I have a suspicion that if I'd been doing this on hard mode, you would I die wouldn't have got instantly. away with those um, with those uh, incoming shots that hit. I think that probably. Um, yes, changes that was the, awesome. Changes the probability. Thank you. Go down to those Shall guys. I no. Do just do that one. No, no, no. Yeah, that one. Yeah, yeah it changes the probability of, of damage when you get hit. I quite like the um. Fight. There's one down there. I quite like the uh, the hyperspace <laughs> effect as well. Oh man! It's okay. going to the left. It's always going to the left. Oh. Blast radius shot. Very nice shot. Yeah, I like the effect. You've got this kind of like blit effect on that. You're really good at this all of a sudden. How are you so good at this now? Uh, just uh, channeling you. You're just copying me. Mm -hmm. oh dear. There you go. There you go. Oh, that's it. Aliens destroyed. What do I get? What do I get? B. I got a B. I got a B. B's better than C, right? B's got to be better than. <laughs> in my, in the game that I usually. In the like games that like first person shooter games that I usually play, uh, I usually get an S rank, which is the best rank. Oh, is it? I'll pop then. Let's move this away from your mouth a little bit. Oh. No! <laughs> oh dear. All right, so it looks like we're playing this again. Oh, did he, <laughs> did he nearly drop the the little you heard it. You heard transmitter it. into your coffee? <laughs> I did hear the ding. <laughs> Bloop. Yeah, look, look at those, look at those um, sort of rain, rainbow cycling effects. Aliens destroyed! Hooray! I quite like. Do, do, they don't look like an Atari twenty six hundred at all. Those bit. We all together, very sophisticated. We. Your grandma's just said hi. Hello, Grandma. Oh, I'm glad it's satisfying to watch. Always get a bit worried that it's map. not very interesting, but map. this is a map. 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 Sorry, sorry. Uh, are you playing on easy or hard? I'm playing it on easy. Do not switch it to hard. Turn it off. Turn it off. In fact, I mean, I, I, it wasn't very successful, the, the supercharger. I think that the company only lasted about two years, and then obviously, obviously every, you know, the whole industry kind of collapsed. But it was a great idea, and they, we played Frogger, we played the official Frogger a few weeks ago. And it's a cracking version of Frogger. And they were able to do it because Parker Brothers had the, had the rights to do the Atari 2600 cartridge Did version. you see those... No, map, map, really map, good map, shots. map. Okay. No, 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 no. What did you do that for? I didn't mean to. And it costs a hundred to just go to the same place. Uh, yeah, Parker Brothers had the cartridge rights, but didn't have any other rights. So. And Supercharger Starpath, had. Yeah, the Starpath were able to. Had didn't have the cartridge rights. No, they didn't need them because they were doing it on tape. So. So they did a version of Frogger, and I think there was there was loads of scope. Arcade quality. Really good. Yeah, okay, there's like one in really sight. Almost arcade perfect um, conversions of there. of arcade games. But I I do like their other games. Their other I games are so weird. They're really quirky. I mean, like Dragon Stomper is is it's Skyrim. A, it's a weird game, but it's good. Would it not just? Um, but it's got a weird name. Die! And their other games. We've got um. Finally. The other game we've got on tape map, is map, uh, map, 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 map. is Escape from the Mind Master. I don't like it. I love that game. I think it's a brilliant game. I hate it's, it. It's a big it's maze. It's so ahead of its time. Yeah, I know. It's a 3D maze. It's a big maze and it's hard and it's mind-boggling. 
Ah, oh, okay, the color rasters are an Atari, Atari 8-bit thing. So, uh, yeah, I, I don't know, uh, I don't know whether the architecture of the... Did you see that? Was that? Good. I don't know whether the architecture of the star path is related to the Atari 8-bits, or whether anyone ever did any cross-programming. Doubt it. Map, 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 map. Do I have to keep doing that? Sorry. I'm just gonna go to this one. Okay. No, it's safe. Map, map, okay. map, map, map. <laughs> and there was there was a game called. Attack of the Communists from Space or something? I think so. That show is perfect. There's a there's a, a TV advert for that game on uh, on YouTube, which is hilarious. That was sleek. Another thing I saw actually the other day is uh, an advert for for um, Pitfall. I think it is. Oh, your long range scanner's destroyed. Meh. Meh. It's alright. Yeah, there's like an original TV advert for Pitfall that features uh, Jack Black when he was like 12 years old or something. It's quite fun. This engine noise is really starting to get under my nerves. Is it? Well, ma imagine being a real space fighter. At least it wouldn't oh, be the same that thing. That was beautiful. Matt, Matt, Matt. At least it wouldn't be just do 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 do. You're just carrying on. You're just gonna. I don't care that you haven't got a long range scanner. You don't need it, mind you. you know where the enemy is. I don't are. give a whole one. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think the enemies move around, to be honest. Uh, like. Unless they do in hard mode. Look. But. Look, they move, look. No, no, no. Between sectors, you know, because. They did, because I saw. Oh, okay. Aliens in two sectors. So are, are they are they really converging on your bases? Because one of the difficult things in Star Raid, especially in Solaris, is defending your star bases from them. Well, I don't really play Solaris like that. I just go around with no idea what I ha yeah. what the heck I'm doing. That is that is true. I mean, and fair enough, you can do that in Solaris. But Solaris <laughs> is m to win Solaris or to actually. You know, defend your bases against the enemies. I think I'd be pretty good at Solaris. I just blow up planets. Also, why is Solaris. Why is the spaceship in Solaris just. Like. It, it's literally got the planet destroyer laser from the Death Star. Yeah. On it. On its tiny little hull. <laughs> you can literally really blow up thing. planets. I think they're supposed to be asteroids. It's Mars! I blew up Saturn in one of them. Well, yeah, that is true. I mean, some of them, some of them have rings around them, which you think, well, that's Saturn. That's a that's a pretty big asteroid to have rings around it. Ow! Oh, you're green. Uh, better go to a space station. Sure, there's one here. Yeah. In fact, don't need don't need to go off map because you just drop automatically. You're down below five thousand energy. There go, ding. Oh, look. Look at that. Hello, bad guys. I bit my tongue while skateboarding on my new skateboard, and it's really annoying oh, me. Yeah. Oh. oh. He just sat in your, right in your uh, reticle there. I'm, I've got good aim. Yeah. He's not. Well, he didn't need it then, because he just literally just sat in your reticle for a couple of seconds. <laughs> Oh, that was beautiful. Lovely job. This could be a, a good sector. The other... Oh, unlucky. Oh, I got him. Oh, more. The other really hard thing There's about Solaris more. is that there are 16... Map, 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 map. You know, whereas you've just got one kind of galactic map. In Solaris you have 16 of them. 
clear. It's clear. Oh, yeah. oh. oh look. Shields. Turn on, turn on the shields. You need the shields when you're like this. Matt, Matt. Yeah, we do. Turn on Go the on, shields. Go warp and then I'll turn the shields on. Turn on the shields. Shields up. <laughs> They're going really slowly. That's cool though. That's so cool. I was thinking, it's very grey. Like, why isn't the background black? And it's like, no way. Actually, you're seeing everything through the haze of your shield. That's why when you hit it... Oh, look. I wonder, what, I wonder if it goes grey when when you get hit without the shield. Or it goes red. What happens if you get hit without the shield? Oh, I think you probably get damaged straight away. I mean, that, I think that's what's happening when we get hit at the moment. And it doesn't actually damage any of our systems. Something going here. Because we have shields on. But presumably, in order to get your, your the really high scores, or to get you know, to get A. Did you a, that see good. that, that good. good good shot? Uh, you have to preserve uh, energy by turning your shields off all the time. Hang up. Nope, mm. Got more to go. There it is. I'm looking at my radar a lot. There we go. Okay. Map, map, map. Stop turning off the shields. <laughs> Why? It's annoying. Turn them on! Turn them on! Turn them on! Bumpy dumpy dump. Did you say hi to Grandma? Yeah. Huh? <gasps> You're done. What did you get? What did you get? What did you get? <laughs> Oh! Hey! oh my god! Pilot level A! <laughs> Maybe it's not S rank and stuff. That's very impressive. Good job. You must have done it quickly. Th those little bars on the right, um, you see the little ticks that are going along. We only space station stopped once. Yeah, I think you did. I think that might have what, be what. I think you did it really quickly, and I think you didn't use very much energy. Did you? Because I kept turning the shields off, so good, good for me. It was annoying. <laughs> there you go. What do you want to do now? I think we should stop streaming. Uh, I think we should have before we go. I think we should have one little go at Star Voyager. Ah! Yeah, just, just to just to close it up, because then the only other space combat game we've got to play is Solaris. We can do yes. a whole stream on Solaris. Yeah, let's do a whole stream on Star Voyager, and then a whole stream on Solaris. You want to do a whole stream on Star Voyager? Yes. But Star Voyager is probably bum. Well, let's play Star Voyager, like, and let's if we get now. bored of it, let's play, let's play that. Play, hmm. well, let's play, the, well, why, why don't we play this on hard, just to see if it's different, quickly. There you go. See, shall I? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you play just it on for, hard, for, you go, you go kill yourself. Just for completion's sake. Oh. You're going to have to, um, do my map. Oh, do my oh, map. I don't do my map want back. I don't want to do this. He said I could come and go. <laughs> can I go? You can go. You can go if you want to. Bye. I will be back. Call me when you've done this. Okay. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna play this for a little bit, and then I'm gonna have a look at Star Voyager. I right, see. I'm already. Call me. Call me when you're going to Star Voyager. Call okay. me when you're going on to Star Voyager. So, so I'm already multiple damage just from taking two hits. Okay. So. Just, just. I don't think I'm going to play this for very long. Just call me when you're doing Star Voyager. I'm going to do it like almost immediately because I'm not going to... I don't think I'm going to last very long on this. Bye bye. I think... Honestly. Like, I'm dead already. Look, like, I've got no torpedoes now. So, in, in my, my first encounter... Flynn? Flynny? In my first encounter, I I lost really all of my stuff. Okay. I'm gonna I'm I'm gonna play Star Voyager in like two minutes, Blen. Is my is my shield even on? My shield is on.
Oh great, I've got no torpedoes. Yeah, I just have to go. So hard mode is pretty brutal, obviously. But again, you—I mean—you can still just return to your space station all the time. It's just—it just takes longer. I mean, as long as you do it before they actually kill you. Basically, this is, I should be going to the space station right now, shouldn't I? Because I think the next shot is going to spell my doom. Oh, managed to get away with it. Yeah, it is a bit of a step up in difficulty. Definitely. see it coming from miles away. Ah! Oh. He escaped my homing missile that time. may be the last time that we load or try and load uh, phaser patrol off the tape if the tape is, is stuck I think we'll uh, it's good that we got to actually prove that it works I think in future though we'll uh, let's do that. we'll run it off the uh, you know part and safely. Oh. Okay. Yeah, so I don't think they can knock out my hyperdrive. Oh. I think I always have recourse to escaping. They can knock out my shields, and then if they hit me again, I'm dead. But I don't think... You know, engines is not a vulnerability that I have. They can knock out my long-range scanner, and, but then, but I can still see where I, kn where I know, you know, the parts that I've already mapped. So... Ah... Oh. It. Where'd it go? Oh, I lost it in my blooming proximity readout. Oh, no. Hard. But it's like the um, alien AI is a bit more unpredictable as well. And is it are there more aliens than in each sector than before? I tell you what, this this game gives the joystick a workout. Hmm. 
I need a comfy joystick to play this game. Which this uh, gunshot is not the comfiest. Not really designed to go in your hand. I think I'm going to go. Got a bit of sunk cost going on in this game now. Because I'm gonna be I'm gonna be really gutted if I get killed without completing it at this stage. <laughs> I only really wanted to try it out to see what it was like, but it, Ooh, that worked out. Gotcha. Escape my homing. Watch you that time. Alright. Well, I don't know where the others are, so. This is genuinely a good game. I'm really enjoying it. Not very responsive moving around the map, I have to say. Luckily though, it's pretty responsive. Yeah. Also, uh, this joystick is running with uh, inverted y-axis, like a proper space sim, which is what I like. I think it would be much harder for me to play if it was, you know, directional. Get away with that. Alright. More of you suckers are there. It's lonely without Flynn. I want Flynn to come back. Who am I going to have to celebrate with if I actually manage to do this? Oh my god, just two of them. Woo! Who's going to do water balloons in a sink with me? Without a computer, what do I know? I'm gonna. Uh, uh, you know, shields destroyed. Oh! Scare the flock out of here!
Ah, how do you evade my homing? Missile. Got you that time. Um. Uh, let's do that. Ah, uh, okay. Oops. Bad guys. Nearly finished it, Flynn. said that, should I? If you lose your groove in this game, it's really hard. What? Torps damaged. going for a high score. I just want to finish. <laughs> I've got three sectors with bad guys in there. Jeez. Yeah. Um, luckily, I don't think I can. No, what's that? Torps damaged. Oh, I don't think I've got... Oh, I do have homing. I don't think my, my reticle lights up. Oh, oh Jesus. How many more have I got in this sector? Shields is damaged. Oh. I'm still streaming, sweetheart. No, sweetheart. I'm 
<laughs> I want to. I really want to finish this. I hope it's still interesting. This may be the only time that I ever actually complete this game. So I'm not going to stop now. Okay, good. Jeez, that was good. Alright, is this the last one? Maybe the last one. I want that. Flynn! I'm about to finish, I think. <laughs> oh, blimey. <laughs> Life sport for the win. <laughs> Let's finish this and go home. <laughs> oh, my God. I hope you enjoyed that. <laughs> I did. That was intense. Oh, my God. That was funny. Brilliant. Okay. That is a great game. That is a great game. Maybe Flynn will come back. Maybe you'll have a look at... um. Star Voyager. Uh, let's just see. How long have we been streaming for now? Quite a while. Okay. I think it's time to have a very quick look at Star Voyager before we go. And see if it's worth playing anymore. So. Bye-bye tape-loaded supercharger game. Let's see what this is about. As I say, I've never even started this game up. <laughs> Proper cheers, thank you. Uh, okay, this is probably going to seem so naff in comparison. I'm not sure I can go back to playing this. I can... Okay. Bad guys. This was quite good actually. What a contrast though. Back to a back to just a basic Atari 2600 game. With a really basic uh, radar and Oh, is that it? Is that, am I dead? I'm dead, I think. I'm dead. <laughs> okay. Uh, so, I'm, I'm guessing... Okay, the number on the left is... Enemies defeated. Number on the right... Is that energy? I really just wanted to have a look at this for completion's sake, um, so we don't really need to cover it properly because I want to get to Solaris, which, oh, what happened A wall. Okay. Ah, uh, okay. 
Okay, are these shots that are hitting me? I think they're shots, aren't they? God. Incredible, isn't it, that this is this is the same machine effectively that was running phaser patrol. And uh, also, I, I don't think this this iMagic game, I think it was a bit of a fast follow for them. I think they just wanted to get in on the Star Raiders bandwagon with it. So it's not as sophisticated as Star Master or Star Raiders, let alone Phaser Patrol or Solaris. Okay. I'll give this one more little... I do like the fact that you can... That the lasers are you can hit them oh my god <laughs> yeah I like the fact that you can hit things with the lasers outside of your reticle oh look what's this firing torpedoes I mean, this might be good if I knew what, oh, what was actually going on. I don't, so. I think I'm going to call it a day. All right. Well, thanks everyone for watching. I hope you really enjoyed that. We managed to get things loaded off tape in the end, um, and it was really rewarding. I'm really glad we did. Um, it would be nice to have a, another camera to show everybody exactly what the setup is and how it works, but it's pretty straightforward. You've got a tape deck and uh, the star star charger, the star path supercharger plugs into it, and uh, you saw how quick it was to actually load. Uh, and the games are really interesting as well, so we'll play some more of those games. Maybe we'll play the ones that we've got on tape another time and play the others off uh, SD card on the Unicart. But I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, please like and subscribe. Thanks Mike and Lee for joining and saying hi, keeping us um, yeah, keeping us uh, connected and uh, answering your questions. Um, we'll see you next week, hopefully. Do you want to say goodbye, Flynn? Do you want to come and say goodbye? No, our phaser patrol really engaging and immersive gave such a great feeling of a game world and jeopardy yeah it really did i'm I've, I've thoroughly impressed with phaser patrol properly good game i did yeah. it you missed it but i did it i managed to complete phaser patrol oh, i heard you hard. screaming yeah. <laughs> okay do you want to play this have one, have one quick go in this and then say, say goodbye it's terrible. What is this? This is Star Voyager. This is what I said. Good shot. It's not that bad. <laughs> you don't... Do you even move? Bye. See you, everyone. See you next week. Do you even 